Hello everyone, this is Energy Crisis, the Energy Drink Report. Okay, so here we are, Energy Drink Review. I'm ready to uh, review an energy drink, you know? It's not like this, uh, actually that was kind of redundant, what I just said. It is an energy drink review, what else am I going to do, you know? Not like I'm just going to sit here and talk for, you know, you know, half the show. <laughs> Sarcasm. That's what I do. Do pretty much just babble on and review a drink ever so slowly. Today's drink is a grenade. Didn't you already do a grenade energy drink? Yeah, already uh, reviewed two of them. Multiple flavors we have. Uh, today we are reviewing pineapple flavor. So pineapple flavored, grenade, vitamin infused energy drink. Some of your nutrition facts here. Serving size 8 fluid ounces, 2 servings per container. Um, 90 calories, no fat, 22 grams of sugar. Caffeine content, 125 milligrams per, per 13.7 ounces. Not recommended for children, pregnant, or nursing women, or those sensitive to caffeine. Natural flavors and colors, gluten-free and vegan. Alright, that's not bad. Uh, not bad at all. Once again, comes in this little almost uh, camo pattern on the outside. Um, lightly carbonated, do not shake, refrigerate after opening. But I do like, it's uh, resealable. So you pull the pin, right? I think you pull the pin. No, 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 it's this way. Pull the pin, right? Doesn't blow up. I was kind of really scared the first time. I was genuinely terrified to uh, open up the drink because I thought it would blow up right in my hands. You know, they call it a grenade for a reason, right? There's such a thing as a hand grenade. <laughs> I had to, had to do that. You're wondering, what am I typing? Um, you know what? You know I'm honest in these shows, right? Uh, you know I am. Um, I'm typing up and searching my videos to make sure I didn't review this drink already, but I didn't. Alright. You know what? I'll be honest. I'm, I'm willing to admit, you know, I just jumped right in here. Um, that's how life is. So we are now pouring the beverage out. We are now pouring the beverage out. Does it look, I think, as I described it in the past show, as a fine Chardonnay? Um, not especially. Not, not especially, really. Uh, let's move it. Let's, let's make the wine glass now the century, century, right, of attention. Um, so yeah, lightly carbonated, some effervescent bubbles on the sides. More of a yellowish color, a vibrant yellow, um, you know, almost like a little lemonade in color. Um, there was some lemonade, I guess it depends on the type, a little more bleached out than others, but this is a vibrant yellow. Um, it's supposed to taste like pineapple. It smells like pineapple already, let's, uh, let's just dive in. Well, if we actually were to dive in, I don't really think we'd be able to, to dive into this drink. I don't think we'd be able to fit in this glass here, but um, I, mean, I guess I could try, you know, but... We'll drink up. The head nod of approval means it's all right. Means it's drinkable and bearable. Now we're going in for the analyzing run. And now I've ran out of terms to make up. So, what does this beverage taste like? Let me guess. Blueberries. No, not quite. Not quite. Um, no, I tried to compare them, but I really can't. Um, no, no, it tastes like pineapple. They uh, did not lie. It tastes like pineapple. That's good. That is a good thing. So it's pineapple, tastes like pineapple. We're done. We could pack up and leave right now, but we're not going to. We're going to waste about, you know, four or five more minutes of your time. Yeah, drink tastes like pineapple. That's it. Pineapple flavor. The thing I like about Grenade, I mean, I've reviewed about three of their beverages. This one included. The thing I like about Grenade, right, is that they have, you know... 
good flavors like pineapple, white grape, pomegranate, you know, this and that. They stick to the flavors, they keep them simple, but they're good. Um, and I like that, you know? I do. Uh, tastes like pineapple, lightly carbonated, a little sweet, but um, you know, they, they really have to be sweet, you know? Uh, but yeah, it tastes like pineapple, a little sweeter, a little lightly carbonated, but that's it. That's really it. They stayed true to their words. Yeah, it is words. Pineapple flavor. That's two words. Uh, they stayed true to their words. And, uh, you know, they did not lie. Now, what is this priced? Well, you know, they sell these in bulk. All right. You could buy a case of 12 of these for 30 bucks. Um, you know, I mean, I understand your dissent, if you will. You just want one of these, right? You know, no, right now I'm stuck with uh, 12 of them. Well, you could invite all your uh, friends over and have a really uh, awkward party where you just gather around and, and drink these uh, grenade energy drinks. I mean, you can do that if you want. Um, that's one way to, uh, I guess, uh, bond, right? Uh, otherwise, you know, they're all right. So let it be known that even if you do buy the 12 of them, they all taste good. Um, so you're not going to get screwed over there. You know, but 12 of these for 30 bucks, you know, it is a novelty item anyways. Um... You know, so if you're like a can collector, I know there are people who do that. You know, it would definitely be something to, to add to your collection. Um, yeah, there are. There actually are people out there who collect energy drink cans. Um, I'm not one of them, but I do know of people who do that. Alrighty then. Well, that's about that. So out of 10, what are we going to rate? Grenade, pineapple flavored, energy drink. Nothing bad about it. Uh, you know, we're going to give these... An 8.5 out of 10. Uh, 8.5. Good flavor, good packaging. You know, it's in bulk. You know, so that's the only thing. But um, otherwise, solid drink. Solid beverage. Um, right now, it's... Uh, oh, really? You got to do, do this with the pocket watch? Yep. 3.50 a.m. Time being. Why do you have to look at the pocket watch? Can you just look at your computer or the clock on the wall? Yeah, yeah. But I just wanted to do that. Um, I don't like pocket watches, and I felt the need to showcase it, but I think this glass might have been in the way, but I was looking at my pocket watch, which is functioning. It's got nice Roman numerals, is the, instead of actual, you know, the Arabic numerals um, on the face. I'm trying to use the pocket watch more. I use it almost every day now to tell the time. Oh, so you're one of those people. Well, maybe I am. Um, I think it's a nice accessory. All right, let's cut this out. Um, you know, I, I could just make a video talking about pocket watches. Maybe I'll do that just because of this. But until next time, thank you for watching. This is Energy Crisis, Energy Drink Report. Thank you for watching. I just said that. Take care. Have a great day. I'll see you later. Pocket watches. They are a good accessory. Don't get me wrong. Um, you know what? All right. All right. What are we at now? Eight minutes and 13 seconds. Yeah, let's take it to nine minutes. Why not? Yeah, so pocket watches, they're, uh, yeah, they're a good accessory. Um, it really, you know, compared to wrist watches or, well, I guess it's your smartphone, right, to tell the time. You know, it, 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 I mean, they've already died out. They really died out in the 20s, you know. It's really, you wouldn't see anyone wearing, you know, the pocket watch with the three-piece suit, you know, in the, the 40s or whatever. I mean, maybe some old guys, but, um, you know, I still wear them. I have three pocket watches. Two, which I wear, you know, every day. I have one, which is like for every everyday wear. It's got a silver chain, you know, a traditional one. Traditional, like, Arabic numbers, you know. That's like regular numbers on the face. And I got this one, um, darker gray chain, and it's got the Roman numerals instead on the face. So that's for more formal occasions, like this one, like a review, where I'm wearing, you know, a traditional black uh, three-piece suit. So, uh, yeah, just trying to kill time here. We've killed enough time. Thank you for watching, and uh, goodbye.